Yeah. I don't know why. I never thought to do that sooner as a precautionary measure. Honestly, kind of makes purchasing the tire locks unnecessary. Oh well. C'est la vie. Salut. Good sound. The agenda for today. Further exploration and inquisition do Utama. Now specifically. Junglin Refinery and they are extended pipeline running from their Genomas oil plantation all the way to the Levy Park. Currently in the Adlo district, the Levy, in the Saint David, the Levervoir neighborhood. Which is as you can tell exactly well Utama and Velero facility out. Also, well, my girl, Cardi B, has been installed since my leaving the apartment she was looking after for two months. Ça va. Along with showcasing the corruption of the, the area, 
du lait, Caria. We may see some wild birds. So let's get right to it. Two, maybe one doing. Come. They don't share the tea. Showcase the thermals, boil the refinery in exploring the part one. Which some degree, oui, j'ai dit about no to the extent that she would have hope. And now, after further research, uh, being in. La villa. So, an extended period of time. She has found out more about. Les corporations affairs specifically in regards a les historic. Propriétaire Control of our large portions of this district at low.
sự on the well mention the historic from what from what she got out it's a mom the mega capra petroleum Production company began in the early nineteen thirties in Canadian Provence, La Canadian Provence, to British Columbia, out of out to the Finally established uh, Anglais oil chain distributor du la same nom. During that time, they grew expansionized, aggressive, a by the nineteen seventies and over two hundred station locations or Distributed their oil product, the gasoline, at near two hundred gas station locations, either soon under. The corporate, the cooperative control, or other station company. J'ai walk too far. Ouais, ouais, there.
a gun in the late 1990s Le Capuchon did a merger with the Mega Capo America Wheel Transportation Company Valero. Which you don't know if it's a car in the 1990s or more modern. Institutional development, but now. Below where your transport is not just not just they are primary transportif but now but is Utemal's power company. Wait. The level oversee Utemal. Then going into the 21st Centennial Hold on Let me get over the other side Wait, there we go Uttermau themselves mm, you don't think on the direct order of Villaro Corporation Pashas a moderate but now Mega corporate American oil, oil production company called Beacon Oil Incorporative, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, have ever seen their primary policy enforcement uh, operations in America since the early Twenty hundreds.
SV der Refinery hier in Levy, Quebec. Construction began in the 1950s. Uh, je believe it was completion in the late nineteen sixty at least the initial facilities do the refinery And since then, is remain at the show more with more renovations, uh, extensions to the facility. John Gillian Refinery has remained with the mouth's largest petroleum production plantation. But the last fifty years Now, don't get confused. This place is not the uh, cooperative headquarter. No, that's in Montreal, Quebec. But this is the place where all the domain crude pollutants come from. Well, no, not in terms of natural extraction 
but uh, well, refine a uh, producing gasoline. Now, you're probably wondering where exactly I'm added. Well, this rule, rule Bernard, I believe it was called. The part of S. A. Petit Park Industrial for Adler. There are Smaller chemical uh, pharmaceutical uh, medicament uh, metal predominant steel uh, Production corporations along this route and back away on a separate route. But this one wrap around the wooded path that run behind the mall right to a session. Do their proprietor proprietor line a jig going to get a closer look before. She head back over to showcase the territory federal that two will have seen before this clip. Back what? To see if I, if she can find anything to interest. Am she going to attempt to cross onto their property? Mm, depend. 
possible Not possible But, well, even if you know Kosovo is some portion, well, you can at least get a well enough view. To lay environmental deplorability. Oh, oh, tabernak. Le air smell. Very pitied. This year, I believe, well, this side here is a prominent mega corporate infiltration company location for. Ville de Levi. She can't tell if the odor is coming from here or from anywhere behind my. Center, Central Passage, Conquessage, et Valorisson, Tibetan, et Pavage. Ça va? Maybe non. Uh, Privé Corporation. Maybe a uh, facility for a division to government municipality. But no what she came here for. She came for this. So According a aerial emoji there should be some trails back here. Let's run along. The portion of the river Eshmon, Eshmin, the river Eshmin, I think. That is within Levy Municipal Borders. And as far as you are aware, most of it is now 
privatized. It is. Government proprietor. So let's head down and see if we can get around to the south side of Jungilmi Refinery. Uh, Let's hope there's no trouble. Barely walked in. No, no seem like it. Well, the smile at my uh, did not stop, uh, did not arrest. Do you scold me? immediately so I think I'm in Leclerc for now Ça va. She go up there, she may come at a western portion of the rail fence for the train. This, this, 
probably the one that take me to the back end, but I check the map again. Well, um, really? So she noticing the amount of pinot tracks other than the un the ones leading along the main trails that are in certain sections of the woods going of course. Possible. It's a mal. Skate petinel. Petrol. Back behind you. Don't know. But I can safely say, other than. That. It is incredibly beautiful. The eyes are in. Here come. Ironic, given the monstrosity. Right next door. Ça va. Let's see if she can be more discreet about getting closer. To the grounds to decide to the main part.
El Nomos. Laurel Cabaret Sean Oh, Cabaret Yeah So Hmm Okay, let's try along here. First blooms of the season. No, just the tank out trains. Those wondering, you believe that tower with the flame is an excess gas banner? To dispose to any extra amount 
do the trolley arm not used by the refinery for operations to sales. Should try and get further over there. These might be waterfall regulators for irrigation that run underneath the time. Yeah. But you're not sure. For any of you out there with the with the shriveled bit of intelligence it goes without saying that uh, all who back here no safe a drink no not at all She may not be a botanist, but to think the she think these are daffodils. Why? The flowers will start blooming in more greenery. Seasonally, they've somewhat adapted to their environment. Oh. It's this.
Mm. Well, je n'ose pas français québécois completely yet. So, if this is telling me to no trespass, eh, je no compris. Sud side de la facilité. Problème. Very open. Vard. Very vard. I doubt they have hidden camera out here, but possible camouflage in a dash to a tree trunk. that je n'en sais but if I get over along here close to where the tracks the rail track that run into the refinery ground you could maybe duck into the patch of wood possible what a try wait Rather, that the room. be able to get any closer than this without uh, risking being seen by all the personnel but if she get over here to these hills which going around there gets to be a part of the two miles proprietor 
she could get a bit of a better look so she try and she has to go all the way back around the creek perfect Well, I doubt multiple field kill have come through here very recently or in very large field kill made its way through here. Again, very recently. Oh. Shall I guess is as bomb as my. What the fuck is that sound? Savon, you dar it. Hmm. No clue about okay. close to the ears.
these trucks aren't mine uh, they look well somewhat fresh but they trail off and disappear possibly because of the rain but I uh, can't tell if they were made today or not Very close. <sighs> Not too many places she can hide if a patrol car or a dump truck do some gain come along here as it definitely look as though they've been excavating this area for some purpose possible Dumping some waste behind here, uh, burying it. Not sure. A possible. Adding an extension to the rear car entrance So that is the entrance to the sud rail track on the ground from what you can see on 
satellite image it is gated so I'm she gonna try try to slink my way up here and crash behind the dirt mound and see if she can capture a better view Atom gone Oh Fine Now phase two Uh, this is as close as I'm getting. There's still something to see. Let's just up. No. Fiquete de Quebec. Cruisers were zipping along the highway as she was coming up here.
Du, 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 du. See this? Just taking a walk. Did you come from? Yeah, well, what's you? She cannot she cannot see. Where? She here. She here loud and clear. And she skidettling. Oh. <laughs> if that was in the view patrols the tomorrow slash video not today Carlis no no do you not think so? Ah, of course. <laughs> Ironically, this is a better image you get then up <laughs> on the hill <sighs> oh well So now that we are away from there, we're going to take a stroll through this federal territory. That legally is for me a le public, but as you may quickly find out, pretty well uh, uh, a large portion of the community actually comes through here and there is no penalty whatsoever that's been given out. It's called in Francais, Femal, JC Champagne and in English JC Chapis Farm. Uh, I talk about it more specifically and I get further down 
but uh, as you will have seen at the beginning of the at the beginning the the video she decided to park KTB right in here wait Salut Cathy They've been here For Two weeks now And From the looks of it Nothing Majorly problematic Have a To do Uh, soon enough, the coming day, she's going to set up camp for the rest to my time here in Levy, down further into the area. Way to will have taken notice to of this elephant in the room. Away. Uh, this is the wheel of the penance that she removed from Gatti. Uh, today, only today, she just sat here for my excursion in the woods. Don't worry, she's not been keeping it here continuous. So, In we go. Hmm. Well, that not look good. Typically, fire uh, hydrants are. Uh, under I oop pressure she going to move away from two now way is the next day Oh, not necessarily not the next day. She was going to record uh, the day after. She took the last portion of the footage, but she got preoccupied with other things so now it's two days later but she back now but on top of that, when she got into the 
Tartary. My farm uh, was dying. Uh, J'ai used the last of the footage to go film a porno video in the woods, which turned out better than she expected on the short notice. Well, we're back. And so, bienvenue to mm. bienvenue à Romain Jesse Chapay Tatai Fatal or welcome to JC Chapay Farm Federal Territory. So it's me walk over here and discuss a bit about it. So if you recall back in my first part of exploration Levy She will have briefly shown the entrance to the area when she was taking a stroll past to a mouse front entrance. And later in the video, she said that she thought it was municipal territory that it was under the authority the government municipal Well, after returning to Villa de la Vie, as speaking to a new friend, she made, she learned that's not the case. It is actually owned up under the authority of the Government Federal. No. Your 
probably asking Pakwa je here Well because it relates to Utamao e Velero as you can see about she get to that in a bit so Qua is Femao Jesse Shampai. Well, originally in I believe the mid to late eighteen hundreds, possibly eighteen sixty to 1890 it was a storage area for colonialist cargo ships transporting agricultural goods to make ports along this portion to the south shore to the river sud and specifically to store livestock Live predominant European animals for agricultural production cows, pigs, eh, poulet, in the mail of the salt. But later on, going in into the twenty centennial, it was. For me, total. Far closed. Due to reasons that she still unaware of, could not find any complete information online about it. So she have to look into that further. It may have something to do with the well Satan Sinage to Willer of Sin or possibly those are not truthful 
et juste des torrents pour trespasser. So it stood abandoned for a long while and in the mid mm, the mid nineteen fifty I believe possibly earlier It came under provisional control due the government federal Canadian. But from everything that she could find, nothing was really done with the area. <laughs> Even to this day, still, well, well nothing of any beneficial use was done, but, well, uh, there are something was done. Unting, un very destructive thing. Let's go over here. So, for an entire cent centennial, the place has stood abandoned. With no real federal activity, going on just under authority by the government federal until about About two years ago, after certain parliamentary discussions in Quebec regarding the area. Supposedly, the government federal decided to put the area to some use. Now, there was controversy as apparently in yeah, the local community. The local community tried to create partitions for it to come under control authority 
du le gouvernement municipal de Lévis. But despite extensive efforts on both majority of residents of the Adlo district, and even many living in Centerville Levy and the Jardin at the Jardin as well as the involvement of the indigenous Militaire pour les Cheddar Appalaches régionales to either transfer to the municipality or private transfer to control of indigenous local government for reservation aside to the villa well none of it worked And the the government de Levy, we we say they try to obtain control of our federal. No, they did not, as they do very much benefit from what ended up happening but four year ago the government <coughs> the government federal Relinquish authority and provisions to a research division of the Ministry of Agriculture Federal. called Agri-Food and Agriculture Canada as you will have seen on the Sanage at the entrance For supposedly the purposes of eventually, eventually bringing either livestock again, as was done over a hundred years ago, or growing crops on the land 
for experimental purposes to test for mega corporate food distributors and production in the agricultural sector economic and that's the current state of it as of today uh, as you can see uh, after three years Division Agri Food Canada and uh, not gotten going on that at all. <laughs> at all. So, again, to clarify, this, under legal pretenses, is no privé, is no propriété privé, is propriété gouvernement fédéral. More so, ministry du Ecocal. And more specifically, Research Division Agri-Food Canada and Agriculture. <sighs> now, that's not the whole history as you can see but you get to that in a minute what I'm going to do now first is see if she can get in to one of these buildings without the attracting the attention of surveillance to see inside. She's not going to go to those ones given the warnings even though they very well could be false. And as for the cameras when she came here first time with said uh, companion they pointed out how most likely there is no hydro flowing at all to this area despite the lampos still in place but as for the cameras well either they are They're not, they're not live. Well, most definitely they're not live transmitting to a security post as an Unless they somehow rigged up self-sustaining, sustainable servers, a wiring connection inside the buildings, I don't think so. But either, point being, either they are recording, but they are battery powered uh, it's on a, a tape 
it's gathering uh, digital record it's continuous recording but not live uh, it's just collecting footage and uh, maybe some agents federal federal maintenance employ come and get the footage and take it back to whatever facility for observation or oh, they are dots they are fake and despite the blinking red light is just designed to do that it's a uh, a prop camera for deterrent one of the two but regardless G am standing here and no federal agents show up and on top of that if you, you not have seen the last video and uh, even a car was here before people from the community local come here all the time and use it as a park way all the time and no police uh, intervention nothing people come here all the time clearly in the line of view to the cameras secure surveillance and nothing my included so let's have a further gander Uh huh. Well, that house looks more in stable condition than any to lay other structures on the grounds despite this camera seeming to be <laughs> oh why you're off mm. you look off but oh, one you're attached to a wood plank I don't see, okay, I see un wire going behind. Oh no, wait, never mind. 
Ouais. Ouais, there's a wire. Hmm. Ça va, hein? J'ai hear a noise back there. Sound like rushing oil. Hmm. Ça va. Let's see if there's another way in. Ah, this is a better view. Mm -hmm. If the oh, uh, damn. Well, where are you on the sugar? No, no, no. Yeah, come on. I'm fine. No, why? Why? Well. Someone else is here. So, uh, if you are a groundskeeper, charged with taking care and uh, maintaining security of Proprietary. Well, you're doing a pretty bad job of it. Oh shit! Why? Two of you. Yeah. You must not check your cameras very often if there are inhabitants of this housing unit. No way. This is someone's maison. No way. No way this is a patch of property privé. Like commercial property privé. On or within encompassed by the territory federal either that or it belonged to a maybe upper middle class resident or in that politician who swung favorability with they are power 
second j tot j Sava, you should just realize something. This is nouveau. Like, this is very clearly nouveau. Like, <laughs> absolutely no way <laughs> there was a gout sportif here in the 18 androids or most likely the 1960s, 1970s, 1980s, no way. And the structures that is in two maisons are very much new renovations. Fresh up, paint, less deteriorated uh, wood, better structural metal, and two perfectly parfait pristine vehicles wait this is nouveau and on satellite map you can see a a piscine a swimming piscine in the yard and from the latest satellite image it look very clean oh fuck it look very clean Uh, oh. <laughs> you don't know why I'm worried about making more noise or drawing too much attention to myself as <laughs> not very well concealed. Anyone here looking through the window or on the proprietary clearly has seen me. If, well, if, if the inside in anywhere in front of a window, they clearly would have spotted my by now. Uh, I'm making plenty of <laughs> loud volume. Savoir. Tabernacle. What the fuck was that? Ah. Hmm. Do you know? I. Do you think? I go. Try get into one of the other structures. Ça va. This is clearly Sumun's residence. At that possible, if no, if not some groundskeeper, 
privy residence. Which is very interesting, very suspicious, considering this is the only rule that runs through this area. Only un, only ru, that does. There's nothing that you can see on the map, at least. And from my walking down below in the port. Yeah. Why? There is someone. Why? Don't know if you can see in the lower basement level window, but why? There's some in here. Okay, let's let's move on the chance that they no notice me. Around here. But from my observations, there are no other rue in the back end going down the cliffside that goes up here, even a dark rue. So if someone live here, they have to drive in on Le supposedly <laughs> les fédéral passants only to get to it. If this is privé real estate, it make more sense if the a groundskeeper but even that is odd considering un from moi and every other common folk it's illegal to go in here well by this point any federal personnel that check on the place know that people come through here. It, it, very clear. Any police patrolling, the Levy Municipal Police patrolling down Boulevard Guilmer Katsu would at points have seen people come through here and most likely filed a report or well, not by this point they know people come through here so maybe they don't care most well most likely they don't care to some degree or another but if that's the case very odd still to have a groundkeeper because nothing happened here. Nothing happened. Well, unless the slightest security for that. <sighs> but 
but if so, they are very uh, incompetent at their employment. Oh, well, this is interesting. This might have been an old field in well from when this wall was a storage center for European livestock being brought into port. Because this is very clearly human, human made, not naturally occurring with the stonework. So well, let me let my git go around. Interruption d'agence dash pompage. I je doubt that any actual gas flowing and piping system requires this so this dodge she keep hearing noises from over there no not like it so this dodge incident so Dante, direction du service de la sécurité incendiaire, Ville de Lévis, Québec. Premier, le pardon, titre et fonction, contrôle météo. André Belanger, titre et Function Ouvert et Quel Maxime Boucher <sighs> uh, That clearly been there for a while. Clearly, the personnel not come here often if it's for inspection of inspection du agriculture. <laughs> well, nothing been done. In regards to that, there are no no crop grown here, no tampering with the soil, the terrain. Is intact. No, no, look like any agricultural equipment, vehicle come through here to prepare the terrain for crop production. It. Oh. Are you just spinning with Lewin? Or did you have actually some electric flow? Do you?
No. No. Oh, ça va. No. Just the wind propel you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what? Qua this? Possia le nan wan mom in cas de tu vas amon mais je In case quoi agence hmm. J'ai picking up on something a little unsettling.
Ça va. My phone is dying again, so she gonna go get some Deja. Gather my thoughts uh, Come back uh, Showcase Those buildings uh, The mouse pipeline Ça va J'ai back Get hours Later uh, J'ai décidé that ça va. J'ai opté against going inside of the building structures for certain reasons, mainly. Les potentialités du airborne contaminants, if possible. But I gathered my thoughts, but I talk about them later, not here. When I make my way back down into the levy for the day, what I will discuss now is that the pipeline but first she's just going a gather some clips of this mess on here because if if I'm not mistaken, this is the oldest structure on the property. So, I'm just going to showcase more of it up close externally.
scotch what she said earlier maybe a possible some amount of the terrain was tampered with for possible future crop growth but not much Saba it time to address this looming presence over the site this is Ultimao slash Villero connection pipeline from the Jungelin refinery out the Levy Quai. It runs from the refinery under level kilometer two all the way down the cliff over another rue along here of rue Saint Laurent and two Velero corporations traditional docking area for their tanker ships a pulling to port and load the petroleum material so from what she could gather this pipeline was built most likely in the late 1990s as photos the oldest photos you could find of it dated back to 2001 It run as you can tell parallel with the entirety the if I'm on GC Shampai's property. It has served as the main dispenser for the largest oil, crude oil shipments. So Ultramar, uh, I believe Laros business activities within Canada. As you can see, it runs right beside residential maison.
So given that this is walls apart again from research of image dating far back of the territory well the pipeline is now was and maybe possibly technically is a part of the territory federal who also since the government federal seizure of the time in the 1950s era. It is very clearly a top priority for Utamar in its mass production given that They seem to be more heavily reliant on it than their transportive tanker truck units and tanker trains. Uh, this I'm very upset. As most of The Laro Corporation's rail transportation in Quebec is done in, from here to by river transport along the river Saint Laurent. Uh, given so well, if you recall earlier in the video you mentioned how Jungelin refinery was Constructed, started, construct. That's 
to be a cleaning product for the pipe was construct was conceived in the 1950s a uh, finished construction in the 1960s roughly and around that time this area was seized by the government federal canadian possibly under provisions of Domain MNL or the land entering into eminent domain. If the previous enemy storage sediment was privé in some form uh, given the time period of the, the time period the rise of Utamal is a mega Petroleum production enterprise she says something Suspicious. Uh, also, this pipeline, with its certain connections within it being made for pushing not most likely oil, but harsh chemical cleaning solutions through it. along with some of the more unsavory looking rusting it no doubt along with the refinery itself has caused mass amount of pollution in the area most likely within the terrain the soil air some amount of Ooh. Contamination. And even though she have seen Utamar official employ inspecting inspecting the area no real rep reparations seem to have been done to it or really no personnel persons seem to go in there rarely at all other than occasional for just checking clearance reports ça va j'ai head back to Vio Levy et discuss more ça va 
to change of plans. She's not going to have time to share my thoughts on the territory federal uh, ongoings with Utama and Velero because she's running out of stars. So she has to do it in the next part of exploration levy. Well, just to give a bit of my observations of the place, my assessment. Well, I found it very strange that the hydro units uh, wiring all the connections plus much of the building structures themselves which you did not take notice of before look very nouveau that's all she say now so hope this was informative it was elaborate but uh, just to say for what she said in the last video no ultramar jungelin refinery is now the privy corporation that she will be infiltrating this guy. She do not have near the resources to do that at Lega Mama. It's another business entity. So Ouais. Bonsoir.